Tonight in this virtual room, we have with us four of the former Youth Poets Laureate, Mia Concepcion, Sydney Brown, Wes Matthews, Husna Hashim. I was a shy kid, you know, I had uh, a few poems that never saw the light of day, never, nobody's ever heard of that. I wasn't ready yet. I actually applied for the position three times. I had a whole year of confidence building before I made that decision. This was kind of my end goal. I, I knew I wanted this. It was inspiring every day to be around amazing poets. And I wanted to be a youth poet laureate because of them. Um, I wanted to follow in their footsteps. What has been the most rewarding about your youth poet laureate experience? There are so many doors that are opened through this position. The continuation of a career that I began at a very young age. Mia Concepcion is an undergraduate student at Temple University studying art education. Husna is a poet, interdisciplinary artist, student herbalist, and undergraduate at the University of Pennsylvania. Husna is the author of the chapbook, Honey Sequence, The Head and the Hand, published in 2018. Brown has been featured in the New York Times, Philadelphia Inquirer. His work has been published in 6805, Gulf Coast, Muzzle, and elsewhere. He's the recipient of the 2020 College Alumni Society Prize for his poetry. Like through the laureate position, I kind of got a more focused, more centered voice of my own. Before that, I was just writing like people who I, I admired. I learned how to like communicate back and forth. Articulation of goals. Schedule things and work around things. So skills that set me up for a lifetime now of work and future career goals. I feel very grateful. The networking that you get to do with such amazing poets across Philadelphia. Engaging like the whole city. Like I was in communities I had never been in before. And collaborate on projects. Community building, that's building connections. My favorite event which you're forming at the Philadelphia Museum of Art. The Poets for Puerto Rico reading. A, a wonderful project we did was the, the Ode to Descent in Unity, where we collected a bunch of verses that we all wrote um, into a collective poem. It was so fun. It feels like an honor, but it also is a position, it's really a position for others. It's as much a civic position as it is an artistic. You're becoming an ambassador for youth voices. You're becoming some somebody that people look to, somebody who may inspire other people to write. Just going to schools and talking to kids. It's like galvanizing, it's, it feels rewarding, it feels like you're doing something. But you know, there is not one correct model of being Poet Laureate. The thing about poetry is that there's so much to offer and none of it looks the same. This is kind of a step on hopefully what will be a really long journey of your life.